Hi there, I'm Glenn Voisey from Connect Multimedia. Today's Sonos tutorial is about using the new feature in version 4 of the software called Sonos Favorites. Make sure you've got the latest version of the Sonos app on your smart device. You go to your app store in order to update that. Once you've got the latest version, just open it and you'll now notice in the music menu there's actually a new item at the top called Sonos Favorites. This is a very handy tool for keeping music that you use on a regular basis in the one location. So you can put radio stations, I've currently got two radio stations in there at the moment. You can put tracks, albums, artists, playlists, whatever you like actually in there and it's a great way to collectively keep stuff in the same folder. So I'm just navigating now to my hard drive. I'm selecting uh, perhaps just an individual track that I want to keep in the favorites. Once I've done that sync the pink here, you can see that I'm, I've got a number of options that I didn't have before, one of which is add to Sonos favorites. So when I press that, it doesn't play the track, it simply adds it to the favorites folder back in the music menu. So if we actually go back to the music menu now, inside the Sonos favorites, we'll now see just one track from ACDC called sync the pink. And if I want to play that now, I simply just hit play now, play next or replace the cue. But that's not all. So you can actually go through and put in Sonos playlists inside the favorites folder as well. So for instance, if I want to add say kids music, uh, I just select all tracks and I add to Sonos favorites. Once again, if I go back to the music menu and have a look at Sonos favorites, as you can see now there's a Sonos playlist in that folder there called kids music. So to play that, I simply just select all tracks. The only other thing probably worth mentioning is the fact that there's an edit button at the top of the Sonos favorites list and that just allows you to either rename or delete uh, files or from just this folder. It doesn't delete them off your hard drive, it doesn't get rid of them, it simply just takes them out of your favorites folder. And last but not least, there's actually one other way that you can add them from the now playing list. The I button or info button for the track that's currently playing you can simply just go and navigate once you've pressed that to the right hand side and it comes up and says add track to Sonos favorites. If you'd like to get the most out of your Sonos system I suggest that you subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook page and check out our website connectmultimedia.com.au that way we can keep you up to date with all the latest trends.